Hey everyone, Inferno here. Jumping into a game called Just Ignore Them, Bria's Story, Tape 1. It's developed by Strang Stranger or Stranger Games and published by Grab the Games. Developed, released on 29th of March 2022. I'll just turn that down a bit. Still a bit loud. There we go. All right, on her way to cover the biggest story of her career, Bria Tenner fumbles her way into a dark, mysterious town called Ash Pines, the birthplace of the tragic events that took place in Just Ignore Them. Bria's story is a prequel to the previous game Just Ignore Them, taking place right before her interactions with Mark. Well, let's have a look. So you've got WSAD, Control C, Run is C, Action Z. Okay, let's see how we go. Jason? Jason, you home? Guess he's still at work. Yep, otherwise he'd be plastered here in front of the TV. I might order some takeout, but first, a smoke. Been hanging for one all afternoon. Now, where do I leave them? Okay. So, nothing in our inventory. Uh, we're going to look at my bonsai, the key to my sanity. Yes, my baby, if you die, so does Jason. Especially if he uses my clippers to cut his toenails again. Alright. Uh, TV. Let's look at there's something hypnotizing about that blue screen. Uh, interact. I bet he lost the remote again. No. Can we interact? Can't do anything with that. How do we get across to the... Uh, telephone. Let's do a quick save. What would you like to do? Save game. Game saved. All right. Fridge. If I leave the door open, I'll burn out the motor. Besides, opening and closing it won't make food appear. Stove. Let's have a look. Cold soup. Ah, looks like we're getting takeout. Sink. Uh, what's under? Blue mug. Can't do anything with it. Let's have a look. Hey, it's where I left them. Behind my mug. Aye, cigarettes. Alright, so let me go to the... Ah, uh, okay. Now, you want to go here. Did that work? Okay, and then we've got the sink. Nice and clean. Alright. Same old joke, stranger. Stringer. Oh, okay. Well, let's pick up this corner. Can't talk to the mug. Okay. So what if we go here and just sit down? What do we go outside? Can't do anything with it. Okay. Interact. Let's uh, use the phone. No. Okay. So we've done the stove. We've done the sink. Done the blue mug. Bedroom. Our box. Let's look at the box. Box full of Jason's stuff. Just some old movies and, a, and his lighter. Hey, lighter found. All right, so cigarettes with the lighter. Hmm. How do I interact with that? Hmm. Uh, it's got the box. So we've got the dresser. Let's have a look at the dresser. It's full of my clothes. 
Don't want to go to bed yet. Uh, shower. Take one soon. Sink. Toilet. Don't need to use it. Ashtray. Just a quick one before dinner. Another day, another disaster. Another dead lead. So much for local big shot journalist, Brianna Turner. Ah, you sure picked it, Bria. Your successful career. You could have been a doctor or a model. Nope, you just had to be the only journalist in this boring ass town. All because your stupid ass boyfriend talked you into it. God damn it, Jason, why do I still love you? Uh, I feel like Chinese food. I'd better order some before I take a shower. Now, where did I put that phone number? Oh, okay. Oh, gee, Lord, what a day. Alright, so if we look at it, it's full of cigarette butts, it needs to be empty soon. Oh, bed. Nice and neat, just how I like it. Can't sleep on an empty stomach. Right, we need to order some Chinese. But where did they put the, th the, um, the number? See nothing special about it. Okay, let's go to the dresser. It's full of my clothes. Don't need to change. Nothing useful there, pity. Okay, let's go to the door. Right, now where's this number for the Chinese? So let's look at the fridge. There's the number. Tanto's takeaway. All right. Can't find what you're looking for? Achieve! Okay, let's go interact. Use the phone. Tanto's takeaway. Chinese Monday, here we come. Yes, hello, I'd like to order. Okay, see you in an hour. Bye. Hope she got lemon chicken. No delivery tonight. Oh, I could use the walk anyway. Whoa, I need a shower. Uh, let's have a shower. He'd better not be using my conditioner again. Alright, we're having a shower. Uh oh. What is this? What the heck? Is that a ghost? Boo! Jackson? Hey, babe. You sack of sh What's for dinner? A foot sandwich, right in the face. A foot sandwich. Yeah, my foot up your buns. I, I'll just check the fridge. <sighs> Alright, so we had a shower. Yo, bae, the fridge is empty. I know, I've ordered dinner. Nice, what are we having? Tantos. Chinese food, nice babe. We just have to go get it. Does that include me? Yes, you want to eat too, don't you? Ah, uh, yes, babe. Come on, let's start walking. It should be ready by the time we get there. Did I forget anything? Come on, Jason. Yes, babe. I'm just going to wait out the front. Uh, okay, so we've got the sign. Tonight's special is sweet and sour pork. I'm getting hungry just looking at this sign. Me too. Ashtray. Nothing special about it. We've got bottles, we got this phone. Let's go inside. Yep, know that. Okay. Are we going to talk to them? Counter? No. Can't get there, no. Can you please stop staring at me, zombie? No. Hmm. Do we sit? No, a door? Ah, talk. Welcome to Tentos. What can I get you? Uh, I'm here to pick up my order. Name? Bria Turnout. Just one moment. Looks like the spring rolls, would you? Just, just a few more minutes. Oh, okay, no problem. 
I'll just wait outside. Yes, mate? Um, you want a soda or something? Sure. I'll see what they have. Are you coming in? Nah, I want to get some fresh air. I've been stuck in the editing room all day, even skipped lunch. How's the footage? You look great, babe. It was just... I suck, don't I? Nah, B, you're a great reporter. Cut the crap, Jason. We're not going to make any headlines around here. This town is boring. These people are boring. I'm boring. Exactly. That wasn't funny, babe. Sorry, Jason, but you see my point. I do, you know. The station's been laying off more and more staff every day. My guess is we're next if we don't get any new material. Maybe we can scare people into watching our reports. Like, bait them in somehow? I don't want to cause unnecessary panic just for a news story. We're not scum, Jason. I know, B, but something tells me that's the direction news is heading anyway. Uh, who am I kidding? I just want to give up. Don't be like that, B. You'll find that good story eventually. Um, get off the crate. Babe, my ass is killing me. I need to sit down. Uh, how does that make sense? If I sit on it more, I'll numb it. Hence no pain. You're an idiot. If you've got a better idea, then let's hear it. Alright, let's go inside and get a soda. Um, can I get a couple of sodas? Sure, I'll just add it to your order. Soda. Uh, let's get... Um, interact. Here you go. Thanks, babe. Listen, I may have a surprise for you when we get home. Jason, this isn't like you. Unless it's something stupid again. Nah, this is much more serious. I may have found you a good story. Come on, really? Remember the last story you got for me? This one involves a murder. Now you have my attention. Come on, spill the beans. Where? Who? I'll tell you after dinner. I don't want to spoil our appetite. Ooh, gruesome, eh? Just where you wait, babe. I'm sure this will be the one. I hope so. Order for Bria Turner. That's us. I'll be back in a sec. Did she just call me babe? So, tell me more about this lead of yours. Huh? Oh, right, the lead. How would you like to cover a... murder? Um, yes. Geez, someone's excited about a murder. You don't understand. This could be our big break. We won't be nobodies no more. I can not finally be an actual journalist. I thought you were already a journalist. Not with the stories that came out of this place. There's a catch, though. It's out of state. So, road trip? You got it, B. The surprises that just keep coming, don't they? You know it, B. I need to calm down. I'm getting too excited here. I'll be back, babe. Just going for a smoke. Okay, let's go outside for a smoke -o. Oops. Ah. I can't believe it. I just can't. Finally, a good story. But how did Jason of all people get it? Oh well, I'm too excited anyway. Uh, look, it's full of cigarette butts. Okay, I feel like something's about to happen. Hey dude, let's look at that address. Heck yeah, we're still going. Dude, she's never been this happy before. I think... I know, but... Really? No outsiders? What's the name of the place anyway? Ash Pines? Sounds like one of those towns in a horror movie, huh? Can you get us in somehow? Like, talk to the cops or something? Please, she really needs this. I haven't seen her this happy in a long time. You know what she's like, man. Please. Yes, dude, I owe you one. I'll pack our stuff tonight. Yes, we'll be careful. Trust me, this is going to be great for her. Jason! Gotta go, bro. Talk later, thanks again. Who is that? Our ticket to success, babe. We leave in the morning. Start packing. I can't wait. I'm going to head to bed early. I'll pack in the morning. Hey, B, does that mean... Don't push your luck. Damn, I will. Uh, come on, then. Yes! Oh, damn, what is that? 
Cuba. Brianna. I'll be waiting for you. Oh, that's a bit creepy. So, where are we going? Some place called Ash Pines. Never heard of it, to be straight with you. I have. I've been there before. Yeah, when? When I was young, Mum used to take me there. We'd sit by the lake and catch tadpoles. Sounds nice. Wish I did stuff like that with my mum. Why? What did you do? Italian family was either cleaning, helping Dad build stuff, or taking a beating. Those flip-flop leave marks. Sounds brutal. Nah, Mum was always right, you know. I pulled my head in, got a decent job, and found a nice girl. Ah, oh, thanks, babe. Besides, you should have seen the girl Mum tried to set me up with. She had a bigger moustache than mine. That's not nice, Jason. I thought she was a lovely girl, if you say so, B. So, what are we going to do once we get there? Well, I booked us a motel just on the edge of town. Once we get there, I'll give you the lowdown on what we're investigating. We're also meeting an informant later this afternoon. How exciting. Almost there, babe. My butt hurts so bad. We've only been driving for a few hours, Jason. What was with that roadblock area earlier? Not sure, but it was nice of the cops led us into town. Did you book our room? Yeah, just gotta check in. What want me to do it? I'll do it. I need to stretch my legs. Okay, babe. Alright, so we gotta check in somewhere. Maybe it's down this way. No. Yes, can I help you? Um, I'm Briatana. I'm sorry, honey. I'm a little busy chat right now. Okay. Where do we go? Oh. Let's save it there. Uh, save game. I'm gonna do it there. All right, I am gonna leave it there for the first playthrough. My name's Inferno. This was just ignore them. Bria's story, tape one, by Stranger Games. Thank you guys for the review key. Came out on 29th of March. Pretty interesting so far. I really do like these little interactive games, little retro games. Good feel to it. And so far, it's got an intriguing story. Thanks for watching. My name's Inferno. I'll see you next video.